new sloping roof line, new rounded fenders, new contoured body sides, new rounded roof, new curved windshield pillars. A new concept in imperial styling for 69. Flowing lines with beautiful contours and gentle curves. A big departure from previous imperial styling. Here to tell you why Imperial has changed to this new styling is Bob McGargle, manager of Imperial product planning for the Chrysler Corporation in Detroit. The objective of the new styling is to put Imperial into the mainstream of the fine car market. The 1969 styling is designed to have wider appeal among the luxury car buyers, and our advanced research indicates that it does. In previous years, Imperial had conservative lines with a stately style that certainly was luxurious, but it appealed to a limited number of people. Today, success comes quicker to thousands of young people, and they're buying in the luxury car market. So we redesigned the Imperial to give it a luxurious appearance in a modern style, so that it appeals to the successful people in all age groups. Frankly, the 1969 Imperial is designed to jar the Cadillac owners out of their long-time buying habits. We believe that they'll want to test drive and compare our new Imperial. Once they do, we are hopeful that their decision will be based on facts, not habit. Oh yes, we accept Lincoln trade-ins too. Thank you, Mr. McGargle. And now we'll look at the facts and features of the new Imperial. The 69 Imperial has size. It's a big car, over five inches longer than the 68 Imperial. And size is important to luxury car buyers regardless of their age. Look closely at Imperial's new front styling. Wide, low, yet massive. Big, bold, beautiful. All protected by a rugged chrome-plated steel bumper that completely frames the grille. Headlights with covers that swing open when the lights are turned on. And the covers blend with the grille when the headlights are off. Cornering lights with three lenses on each front fender are standard on all Imperials. They illuminate darkened corners so the driver can see where he's turning. The third lens contains Imperial's side marker light. Rear styling is impressive too. Big, luxurious, beautifully contoured. The massive bumper blends with body lines, forms a full width protective shield that extends up into the fender peaks. New sequential turn signal lights set within the bumper flash a moving signal in the direction of a turn. Backup lights are inboard of the turn signals. A small formal rear window, hallmark of prestige cars, is standard on LeBaron's. And so is the rich textured vinyl roof, available in six different colors for 69. Imperial is offered in three models for 69. LeBaron two-door hardtop, LeBaron four-door hardtop, and Crown four-door sedan all with long 127-inch wheelbases. In this view, you can see how Imperial's body curves out from the roof to the belt line, and in again from the belt line to the sill. Even the roof drip rail is recessed to keep the side contour smooth. A practical benefit of this curved body design is more interior roominess, four inches more shoulder room in the front seat and three inches more in the rear, all because the body slopes out at shoulder height. The luxuriously comfortable 50-50 divided front seat with passenger recliner and thick foam padding is standard on the LeBaron four-door hardtop in cloth and leather trim. This leather trim is optional. Standard trim on the LeBaron two-door hardtop is cloth and leather with a bench front seat and pull-down center armrest. Leather bucket seats with center cushion and pull-down center armrest are optional. The Crown Sedan interior trim is rich cloth and vinyl with a bench front seat. It also features a pull-down center armrest. There is no optional trim for the Crown. Easy Glide Power windows are standard on all 69 Imperials. A lockout switch on the driver's door can be used to keep children from operating them. Imperial's new six-way power seat adjuster has three switches for easier control. You can select an infinite number of seat positions. It's available on all models. Imperial's ultimate instrument panel. Straight line styling, luxuriously trimmed. The rich wood textured vinyl on the glove box is repeated on door trim panels. Safety padding all around. The instruments are clearly marked. Controls are within easy reach of the driver. Gauges are used for alternator, engine temperature, oil pressure, and fuel. No guessing here. 
At night, Imperial instruments and controls are softly illuminated by indirect flood lighting. New safety reminder lights on the instrument panel alert passengers to fasten belts and lock doors. Imperial's exclusive sentry signal flashes a check gauges warning if fuel or oil pressure are low, or if the engine temperature is above normal. A separate brake system warning light goes on if brake system pressure becomes low. Armrest storage compartments with beautiful bright metal interiors are an Imperial exclusive. There's one in every door. Every door on LeBaron models has a courtesy light that illuminates the doorway anytime the door is opened. Lavalier straps on rear roof pillars are a LeBaron four-door hardtop exclusive. They give a comfortable hand support, then rotate automatically into storage position when released. Vinyl-covered pillows are a new luxurious LeBaron touch in the four-door hardtop. Head high and super soft, they provide relaxing rests for long trip snoozes. Convenient reading lights, combined with roof courtesy lights, let a rear passenger read without disturbing others. Switches on rear armrests turn the reading lights on individually. They're standard on LeBaron hardtops. Rich leather portfolios are standard on the front seat backs of the LeBaron four-door hardtop. They make handy files for brochures or important papers. Napped nylon headlining has a soft velour look and feel. It's standard in all Imperials except those with white interior trim. White gets a vinyl headliner. Carpeting also has a richer look for 69, and it's more durable. That's because it's made of 100% nylon and has a deep cut pile weave that's soft underfoot. Bright chrome-plated door handles swing out when pulled, retract when released. Wood textured vinyl inserts form a beautiful background. Silent closing door latches with latching posts mounted in rubber give Imperial doors a quality sound when closing. The latching is quick and the sound is muffled. You will notice that the push button lock on the LeBaron two-door hardtop has been moved forward on the door where it's easier to reach. A little thing maybe, but a big convenience. This doorway entrance enlarger is an exclusive on the LeBaron two-door hardtop with bucket seats. A power adjuster automatically moves the passenger seat forward when the seat back is folded down, makes it easier to get in and out. The LeBaron two-door hardtop is styled with a ventless front door window when it is equipped with an air conditioner. With air conditioning, who needs vents? Cleaner windshield styling results from new concealed windshield wipers. The appearance is clean and uncluttered. The double arm wiper blade on the driver's side cleans close to the windshield pillar. It has a dual action that lets it sweep parallel with the pillar, giving the driver an extra four inches of visibility in this area. Safety seat belts for the driver and right front seat passenger have concealed retractors. Front wheel power disc brakes are standard on all Imperials. Imperial's big 440 cubic inch V8 engine develops 350 horsepower. Smooth and efficient torque flight has a new part throttle kick down. It quickly and silently downshifts into passing gear before the accelerator is pushed all the way to the floor. Does away with engine wind up noise. Imperial's parking brake releases automatically any time torque flight is put into gear. The automatic release makes it impossible to drive away with the parking brake on. On the road, Imperial's ride and handling control is supreme. Torsion bar suspension with special rubber isolation between all suspension components and the car body make the ride smooth yet firm and responsive. For 69, Imperial offers fiberglass belted tires as an option. They give up to 40% more tire life according to tire manufacturers and considerably more traction on either wet or dry roads. Imperial's new features go on and on for 69, like the new simplified autopilot with controls in the turn signal lever and the new AM FM stereo unit with stereo tape player and five speakers to fill the car with luxurious sound. But Imperial's big new story has to be the sweeping new styling that makes this the finest luxury car. With new sloping roof line, new curved body sides, and new windshield pillars, new contoured styling that makes Imperial the newest and most beautiful prestige car in the luxury car class for 1969.